Hi, it's Michael Lofito, author of the book Luxury Listing Specialist and founder of the Luxury Listing Specialist Certification. The new and improved. We just went from 14 modules to 16 modules. Check it out, LuxuryListingSpecialist.com. In this week's video, we're going to talk about the importance of having three presentations when you're working with buyers and three presentations when you're working with sellers. So the focus of this video is having three listing presentations. Having not a one-size-fits-all listing presentation, no matter what, no, you have to adapt to who you're talking to. So before we go into that, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, check it out, marketingluxurygroup.com, and like our videos. And if you haven't done so, uh, please leave us a review on our podcast. All right, so you're going on the appointment in a few days. You need to do the social media scrub. We've released a previous episode talking about the social media scrub, doing your due diligence on, on your potential client ahead of time to find similar likes and interests. But the other reason you're doing it is you want to know what their personality type is. So one of the things that we offer agents that have our certification is they get our prospective seller application. It's a five page document and we know how motivated they are before the appointment. We know what their personality type is. We know what their preferred communication style is. We know what their expectations are of me as an agent and what the go to market price is. These are all things that we ask. And so if you are interested in the prospective seller application, you should check out our certification. But where I'm going with you on this story Bottom line is you need to have three types of presentations. So if you're going to be sitting across the table from a bottom line in the disc personality, a driver, a D or an I, they're fast paced, just bottom line it, what do you charge? Don't pull out your laptop with your 100 PowerPoint slides, you're going to lose them. So you got to have a fast paced listing presentation for the D and the I. You have to have a slower paced presentation for a S or a C. If you're not familiar with DISC personality, we've included a link. Tony Robbins, the motivational speaker, has a free link on his website for you to take a DISC personality profile. We've included that. Take a DISC personality profile. When you learn about what personality, yours is your predominant and your secondary. Most real estate agents are high I. Again, there's an old adage out there, shy real estate agents have skinny kids. You can't be shy in this industry, so most real estate agents have a high eye. So you gotta have a fast paced, a slower paced, and then the third presentation is a mixed presentation. Maybe the husband's fast paced, and the wife is a slower left brain analytical. So that's very important for you to understand that. My name is Michael Lofito. The last thing I'm gonna tell you about is the airport story. The simple explanation of a disc personality is the airport story. If you are running late to the airport, a D or a driver, somebody that's dominant, cuts people off, they're focused on winning, they're focused on getting there, and they come across a little harsh sometimes because they're focused on results. That's a D, that's a driver, that's a bottom line guy. The I is the life of the party. They compliment everybody. Oh, hey, how are you doing? Oh, man. And they talk themselves onto the plane because they're likable and they attract people with honey. The S, there's, th those are the steady people. They don't smile much, but they're great listeners. Those are the buyers. You show 50 homes and after 50, they're back to square one. They can't make a decision for the life of them. You go out to dinner with an S and they order their steak medium well and it comes burnt. They don't speak up because they don't want to offend anybody. So guess what happens? The S shows up to the airport and they don't want to cut anybody off or m mess up anybody or ruin anybody's day and they don't speak up and they miss their flight. The C is the left brain analytical seller. They're at the airport two hours late, they never miss their flight. So you gotta really know what kind of personality profile you're dealing with and then you adapt your presentation towards them. Again, to review, three types of listing presentations and buyer presentations. A fast paced for the D and the I, a slower pace for the S and the C, and a mixed presentation for uh, a mixed, you know, buyer, excuse me, a mixed seller, husband, wife, or husband, husband, whatever it is. You gotta know your clientele. Do your social media scrub, and you should come up with some kind of prospective seller application like we have. My name is Michael Lafito. My contact information is below. If you have any questions, let us know. I hope this was informative. Take care.